Dennis, what's the biggest takeaway and the message to the group after a loss like this one? Got to finish games. And what shifted and what changed in those last few minutes when the Clippers went on that 22 to 0 run? Um, I don't know. I got to go back and watch. I got to go back and watch it. When you look at the offensive game that you guys had, shots were falling. Was there anything that the Clippers did defensively that slowed you guys down? No. When did the shots, when the shots weren't falling, how were you guys not able to kind of get back to that rhythm and getting back to your spots? I think it's about how we was getting the shots. We kind of strayed away from that. And we started um, trying to hunt matchups, going one-on-one, -on -one instead of just letting the, letting the game flow, letting it come to you. Uh, we went away from that, and that's when it got tough. Was that, was that kind of on you guys, or did they start switching more to kind of lure you into that? I think it's us. You know, I don't really too much believe in them dictating what we're going to do, so i say it was on us. I know you all take it game, game by game, but you guys close out January at home. Does that help kind of reset things for you? I'm hoping so. I'm hoping so. It's less travel. You know, we've been road running as of late. So we get to be home, rested. Um, you know, that should be an energy booster for us, playing in front of our home crowd. You guys have talked about how you're one of the leaders and the vocal leaders in this locker room. You look at how this road trip started here in Portland. You got a big one on Friday and then this one, a loss here tonight. What do you want this team to kind of take away from this three-game road trip as you kind of carry it back home? Um, to understand we could play with anybody. You know, I want everybody in the locker room to feel like we're going to win the game when we come in. It sounds crazy, but it's a real thing. You know, I want everybody to believe we can come in and win the game, don't matter who out there. And, uh, you know, if we had that belief and if we take that from this road trip, you know, that's a positive from it. What was the, I mean, what was the message in here after the game and who were the, who were the loudest voices, I guess? Oh, we just listened to JV. What was his message after this? Uh, you're going to have to ask him. When you guys are this deep into the season, and I understand that there are obviously runs, but for when it's 22 nothing to close the game like that, um, timeouts, whatever, how disappointing is it that I guess you guys couldn't find an answer even to kind of staunch that a little bit? Very disappointing. Very disappointing. We played a good game and we blew it.